वेलकम टू क्लास फोर चैप्टर नंबर फाइव अनीता एंड हनी बीज सेंट थॉमस स्कूल मोवा आई एम सुरेश सर एंड आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू चैप्टर नंबर फाइव बिफोर द कंटिन्यू द स्टोरी आई वॉन्ट टू इन्फॉर्म यू ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स दैट प्लीज कंटिन्यू राइटिंग ऑल्सो टाइम टू टाइम वेरी सुन we are going to start a revision for lesson number 1 2 and 3 in this story anita koshwaha was living in a one muzaffar districts bocha village and she was studying in the college and teaching the young children and keeping some part of honey bees then she was saying the story that when she was young it was not easy for her to spend all the time for this all work she wanted to go to the school but parents used to say her that go and spend some time with the gods as they guest for the food she couldn't get time so going to school the idea of parents they did not like as she was a girl later on she joined it children this is the true story of anita who is ideal for all the girl child who have changed their life by going to the school second thing where bihar is located in our map of india that also we have to see a dream of school the story starts from the dream of school one day when she was reaching and she was sitting behind the children and anita felt very happy when i came back to the home collected courage to talk to my parents about the school but they clearly told me not to go to the school as she has to look after the gods the teacher of that school knew about her and slowly slowly explain the parents about the importance of the education dear children now we are very aware about it but in olden time girl students rarely go to the school for learning or study this is because of only one reason that they have to help in the household work the teacher also told them that it is the basic right of every child to go to the school slowly slowly anita's parents agreed and she started going to school i was not so intelligent but then she was always asked a question and she got some idea about the studying and learning this was the main possibilities now this is very interesting table being as a student you should know it what your parents are doing for you so i request all the students to feel this when you come to the school what is expense how many rupees notebook you are taking pen pencil you are taking uniform rupees school bag amount lunch box shoes and footwear other things what you are spending for your study that you make a total i think it will come in certain 1000 rupees of the total that much amount your parents are spending for you it is very common nowadays that all the parents are giving you good facilities that is very nice thing they are encouraging you how much money did you spend on your books this year that you have to note down by yourself if i am bringing my notebooks then i have to note down my amount that is very common then this is the rest of the story the study is continued anita story and she started whenever in this story she say 
then i passed the certain classes and increased my studies and uh, then parents were not ready for the education but she started learning and very important thing anita did for other student is she started teaching to the other younger children friends that is very important you know then you are encouraging others to study it to continue the study now what she said slowly she started talking to the other parents in the village and encourage girl child to go to the school and mother was also helping in the household work and slowly slowly anita become a one good inspiration for all then whenever she is getting time she was started studying next now anita story is taking turn from the study part to the earning parts then what she say there are so many lychee trees in the area ani bee is attracted by the lychee flowers so so many persons are keeping the bee as a in a hive and government is training government is giving training for it and anita joined and slowly slowly she started cultivation of it honey bees i was only uh, girl in this training program that anita was say when she started joining and honey bee lays eggs from october to december and started keeping the bees then they have asked us have you seen any insect near the flower what they are doing find out the names and write we can we have seen in our school that butterfly it sucks juice from the nectar of the flowers you know it very well why do they come to suck the juice from the flowers then they collect it in a special honeycomb in a honey bees honey bees are specially attracted for this fly near this kind of the flowers and suck juice from it and put it into the particular hives a one picture is also given a one honey bee is sucking a small kind of juices from it furthermore next period we will see about our continue class of this till then please read the lesson very carefully thank you